know, it's fun wandering in the woods. You know, ambling around, mm -hmm. and seeing what's what. <coughs> Listening to bird calls. But this is a good sign that this a smallish turtle is sitting out on a day like today. My expectation uh, was that this turtle, oh, cute you name. know, would would be in, you know, sort of tucked in and under. But you know, there uh, she is. That's the transmitter. Oh, transmitter. This is the transmitter and the <laughs> oh, yeah. and the antenna. Uh, and so this has a single battery, which you use on the smaller turtles. We have double battery transmitters that last um, up to 12 months. And we put those on the... It's on like two long teeth, but it's his nose, right? It's, no, no, it's probably slug. Oh, those two yeah. nostril-looking things are slug? Well, on her lips, she's got slug juice and slug parts. <laughs> no, those are just colored dots. That's part of the, the scaling on the face. But she's got, she was eating or something. There's some, some slug juice. So if somebody wants to hold her and pass her around. And we haven't seen this turtle in a while. These pines have struggled their whole lives. That's why you see a lot of dead ones in here. And there are some native pitch pines creeping in, but there's still a lot of big scotch pines. A lot of the red pines are, 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 fa are failing. Uh, but this is a, you know, we say is a typical, um, you know, box turtle habitat. Notice the ground is very, very spongy. Yep. Lots of yeah. litter. Uh, under it, there hasn't been a fire through here to burn the duff off. And anyone else want to give it a count and see? Yeah, someone else count it. You know, and so you've got a lot of leaf litter. And you also have the next generation of woodland starting here. These are black oaks starting to grow. You may have noticed on the driveway coming in a lot more black oaks. There's also white pine in here. White pine is likely to be the climax forest in this particular area.